Lizzie Stride, the leader of the Dead Eels, is somewhere inside Coldridge Prison. The former Lord Protector's escape has put the place on high alert. Oh, we have two runes, so we can get the first level of pull now. Heck yeah. Money, ammunition, and keys can be pilfered from a distance. I should choose where I want to put this. On zero? Oh, I think it... I think it reset all my hotkeys for these things. There we go. I think that's pretty good. There's not really any point in assigning stuff to like 7, 8, and 9. That's so far away from WASD that it's... I might as well just hold down the middle mouse button to get this menu and select it from here. But yeah, most important thing is to be able to switch between blink, uh, sleep arrows, and then stuff like void gaze. Uh, did I upgrade void gaze to the point where I can see enemies through walls? I don't remember. Yeah, I did. Yep. Cool. Oh, that's what I'm hearing, the music from the Overseers. Doesn't really sound like music. It's kind of horrifying. What happened to them? Oh. Thank you for the favor. Corvo came through here, yet the gate still hasn't been repaired. Who needs a gate? If anyone tries to escape now, they'll be vaporized. Arc Pylons, Sokolov's latest. That's if they're operational. The second you run out of whale oil tanks, you're defenseless, and the prisoner goes straight out to the bridge. Exactly. Which is why we drain the water lock. No one survives that fall again. Still, the Lord Regent won't tolerate another escape. We have to be extra careful. I guess I could just ignore those people and just go right up here. They don't hesitate to kill their own. Corvo Watano's disappearance from custody. For gross dereliction of duty and the reasonable suspicion of treasonous conspiracy. Ready. Game. Uh, I saved one. I didn't think they'd shoot so freaking fast. Bastard. Oh. Well, no one else seemed to freak out. Over that prisoner running away. I think we're okay. Alright, we got the super far. Oh, the music. Magic will not work. Not even, like, void gaze? For the entire prison, or...? I think it's probably going to be for the entire prison. Is 
Don't think there's any anybody left in the yard. Reinforced bolts. Bolts stuck in enemies break less often. Eh. The Sewers Beneath Dunwall. Excerpt from a light historical overview of the architecture of Dunwall. Across the generations, the aqueducts and tunnels beneath the city of Dunwall have served a variety of purposes. In the earliest days of the city's history, several primary canals were used to channel river overflow during times of flooding. And for a time, it was fashionable for wealthy aristocrats to commission underground water passages, giving them, giving them access to their estates from the Renhaven River and its minor tributaries. Over the years, these tunnels began to interconnect, sometimes by design and sometimes by accident. The history of the tunnel system is rich. As every school child is taught, rebels used the sewers extensively during the Morley Insurrection. As discussed in popular bar songs, lovers often find privacy in some of the cleaner entry points, with fresh air brought in, the, in on the winds from the river itself. On a darker note, in addition to seeing traffic from gangs and smugglers, it's rumored that the current royal spymaster himself, Harem Burroughs, has a network of informants who know the twists and turns of the sewer system by heart. Until recent times, the older tunnels suffered from repeated collapse, creating sinkholes that occasionally consumed entire street corners. The current system rarely suffers from such calamities since the sewers were reinforced and expanded by the city planning department during the rule of Emperor Euhorn Caldwin I. I think my first order of business is going to be trying to disable the music, right? So I can use my abilities. God. Uh. Why did you save me? I'm looking for Elizabeth Stride, a prisoner. A gang leader out of Draper's ward. Heard her come in. Section D, cell D24. She fought like a wildcat. You can check the logbook in the guard station between section C and D. Oh, that's so cool. I didn't think that would turn into like an actual thing, but it did. Is there a way in up there? Ah, oh, there is. Oh, is the high jump considered magic? It apparently is. Damn. God, it's weird how familiar this looks because, yeah, we escaped from here in the game as Corvo. I remember this specific place right here. <coughs> how quietly can I f fall down here? I should probably just shoot him with a trank dart, huh? Oh, there's another one. Stupid goddamn Dublin son of Marlon Gunnerman. Oh. Well, we're not getting hit by the music anymore, are we? No, we're not.
I just close this so they won't be able to see me? No. That's probably going to open that. I don't... I don't think I want to, actually. I'd rather go over rather than create a huge noise. Remember that an overseer has been summoned to address the situation in the interrogation room. Until the overseer arrives, no one is to enter the interrogation room. The prisoner cells are off limits to overseers and other visitors. No exceptions. Test out our grab ability. Can we like grab? I, don't know. I want to grab that bottle. I guess I can't reach it from here. Oh, haha! -ha. That might be worth checking out. You bet. Or maybe not. That's weird. I <laughs> can just steal her money. I love it. Uh. Oh, there's glass there, so they'd be able to see me through it. Hmm. Oh, whoa, why are you coming this far in? You might see a body. Prisoners who have been transferred from Section B will be observed for signs of infection. Oh, my God. Why did you end up over there? Jesus Christ. No, no, no. Oh, they dead. I don't know why I'm taking them. It's not like it matters. I need to disable that arc pylon. All prison personnel will stay clear of the interrogation room until the representative... I want to make sure there's nobody in here. ...it is free of any heretical corruption. We're safe. Log update. Remember to take extra care in logging transfers. Even temporary transfers of prisoners from one cell to another must be recorded in the logbook. Ensure that the logbook is available in the guard booth between section C and D at all times. Morris lost his nerve at the sewer gates. Neither of them knew anything. They died to satisfy the Lord Regent's office. And Officer Thorpe? Thorpe slipped him the key. Everyone knows that. He got weak. They paid him off, but he couldn't tell us who it was. And believe me, he wanted to by the end. You've seen Corvo train, haven't you? Once he had the key, there was no stopping him. And the way he went off that bridge? How do you stop a man who'll make a jump like that? Like he doesn't care. Or like he's more than human. You think he's a... Uh... I think we played that overseer noise for a reason. I think there's more happening here than any of us know. 
All cells in Section B are under quarantine until further notice. Prisoners who have been transferred from Section B. I don't think this is important. Not really. It doesn't seem like it. Just make sure to do this. Make sure to do that. That. But I can do it. Once the cell doors open. You? How? In the first rush, I take two. Before they get their swords out, pick up their pistols. I'm a good shot. How good? I'm better than most of the people here. It's a fact. If I keep moving, I can take the rest one on one. It'll be bloody, but it's doable. You're not thinking. If a fight even starts, you can finish. When that alarm goes, your odds are just about zero. Me? I just keep quiet. <coughs> Slip by when no one's looking. Take as long as it takes. <clears throat> Either way, you'd have to be lucky. And a complete mess. You'd have to be Corvo. remains under martial law. Guards are authorized to use lethal force against any unidentified or unauthorized persons on the premises. Come on, you heard it break. noise because of me. Rewire. Oh, it'll now harm enemies instead of me. Oh no, that's actually not what I wanted to do. I thought it would just disable it. Well. It is what it is. See if I can attract them over there. Oh, not sleep darts. Just normal ones. All prison personnel will stay clear of the interrogation room. Somebody said I heard something, but nobody's moving. Certified it is free of any heretical corruption. They hear it, but they just do not care. Ah, oh, that's the power. Should I disable it? Well, I guess not. Let's let it, let it do its thing. I could get up there. Also get up there. I don't know. Up here looks fun. Oh, oh, oh! All cells in Section B are under quarantine. 
until further notice. Prisoners who have been transferred from Section B will be observed for signs of infection. The key to the ammunition locker. Looks like we just got it. Why does it always make so much? Why'd your body go there? Come here. There's a rat in my cell. Can someone get in here and kill it? Yeah, it's nice. All right, nothing here as it turns out. Probably rats. They're everything. Yeah, Void Gaze is super useful. I really should have invested in that earlier in the first DLC. <laughs> Do you think the prisoner would freak out if I choke this person out? I, I really don't know. It could go either way. That's a lot of rats. Lizzie's tried. She's in rough shape. Just need to find a way to open this thing. I wonder if it makes more noise to drop them myself than it is if they just drop on their own. I don't know. Ooh, choke dust. Wait, is that different from what we normally have? Noxious cloud, temporarily, temporarily blinded and disabled. No, that's the same. our faces. He could come back any time. not want to rewire that. In fact, I don't even know what this thing is. Oh, it's an alarm. What does rewiring it do? It's not like it can alarm for the enemy. Or I guess it could, but what would be the point? Oh, yes. This is a lot of stuff. Stun mine. I know what that does. It stuns. Position. As requested, your special order has been filled. Thank you.
Rouse yourself. Wake up. Someone get over here. Do it, do fuck. I was gonna say don't shoot, but god damn it, they did. Okay, hold on, hold on. Anybody running here? Anybody alarmed that I can get slow motion before they set off an alarm? Uh, no, actually. I think we might be okay. Yeah, wow. I thought everybody would hear the gunshot. Elizabeth's trying to move to... Uh-huh, I don't think we really need that information. We know where they are, we just need to open it. Um, I've made a mistake. I need more men. No, you don't. Yoink. Go in here, close the door so nobody sees. He's up a lot of mana doing that. How much mana do I have left? Mana potions. Three more. Not bad. You know, I keep using slow motion as an emergency kind of thing. I should probably put it somewhere easier to access. Number four? Yeah. You think Corvo's running around the city in a mask, executing people he doesn't like? You're crazy. I'm telling you it's him. No, no. I've seen him. Remember? <laughs> oh! Wow, that is really saving my ass so many times. Oh shit, there's someone else. The Sokolov radial interdiction oh. arc pylon is for use only by personnel trained in proper Wow. Whew. I think we got some cleaning up to do. These bodies are way too out in the open. Are the rats gonna eat this if it's only a couple rats? Is that a snack, or do they need to be in a group? They're very polite rats. They wait for the others until they start snacking. Bodies really don't go where you want them to go, do they? They just, you try to put them down gently and they explode with blood and noise someplace ten feet away. <laughs> Look at that. Looks like I launched them at the wall. Is that a prisoner? What am I looking at? Oh my god. They're very, very dead. Ah, oh, I think this is the con cell control system, yeah.
This controls all the cell doors. Oh, I need to select the cells. Oh. Procedures following the escape of Corvo Atano. Following the escape of Corvo Atano, the council appointed by the Lord Regent has decided it is of the utmost importance to increase security measures at Coldridge Prison. The recommendations made <clears throat> the recommendations made by this report include structural measures such as increasing the heights of walls, sealing ventilation shafts, and ensuring sewer entrances are inaccessible. Additionally, staffing at the site must be increased to thoroughly cover all exits and maintain observation of all major corridors. Addendum. In addition to the new measures outlined herein, the Council has consulted both the Abbey of the Everyman and Royal Physician Anton Sokolov, who is also head of the Academy of Natural Philosophy, asking for guidance and equipment in the handling of those cases which are more exotic in nature. While we have dismissed reports of the supernatural in the past as old wives' tales and lunatic hearsay, Recent months have convinced us that there are matters afoot that we do not fully understand. As such, prison executive personnel are encouraged to welcome the presence of both the overseers and anyone working under Sokolov's technical guidance. So, yeah, do we have to go back, or does it tell us? It does not tell us? Clues? Oh no, it does tell us some clues. Of course, there's still others I want to open, though. D24. Oh, that made noise. Oh, I love the way that resets. Now we need to note down all the ones... All the ones that we need to open, or want to open anyway. Like up there, for example. Where does it say the cell, though? Not in massive, obvious letters, unfortunately. Actually, yeah, kinda. D21. Gotta write them all down. D21, I know there's others. Sorry, I'm not gonna get you just yet. Oh, that is very loud. There is stuff in there. That's... A13. See, the problem is I'm writing with a pen that's basically dead, so I'm gonna have to, like, read the scratch marks in this letter that's on my desk that I'm scribbling on. We'll see how that goes. Oh, there's a bunch of stuff in here, too. A25. Until the representative from the Abbey has certified it is free of any heretical corruption. I don't know, there's some stuff there. I'm not quite sure what cell that is. I think the one with the person in it? Looks like some minor stuff, like a little bit of money. I'm not gonna worry about like little things like that. Yeah, same with that. Just some like bread or something. Okay, D21. And then reading my scribbles, A13. And then A25.
Oh, it's in the toilet? <laughs> That's disgusting. You better be good. A witch's skin. When taking damage, your mana is drained before your health. Penalty. Mana does not regenerate. Oh, that is not worth it. God. I'd go through so much mana if I didn't utilize the regeneration feature. I forgot that that makes the thing actually happen. Right. The other one's up here. Baffle dust. Does it baffle people? Ethical experimentation. I've managed to get my hands on an experimental formula being tested right here in Cold Ridge Prison. A mixture the prison guards call choke dust, which is normally capable of rendering prisoners vulnerable for a few moments. However, this new formula has the potential to make the victim forgetful as well. It's as if, once breathed in, the dust causes an acute temporary stupor. Modern incarceration technology. Oof. I don't... I don't know if I feel like reading that. That's some real heavy reading. Prisons of the Isles. Same. I don't... I don't feel like reading that either. I'm sure it's good, but like... I'm just not in the mood to read about prisons. Prisons suck. Yeah, I already went in there. Okay. Oh, God. I have to carry her out. They can't walk. She'll need to be carried out of Coldridge. Okay. <coughs> That's gonna make this challenging. I suppose the way is mostly cleared. Yeah, nice. Where did I come in from exactly? Did somebody pull an alarm? Did they detect that I took... Took up... Sorry, I forgot their name. Lizzie. Did I took Lizzie? There are unsecured prisoners active on the premises. Hmm. All Cold Ridge personnel detain or kill anyone currently in a restricted area. Oh, fuck! Uh... I thought I had the right thing selected to... Blink? Ooh, that's bad. Um... Uh, I'm not really sure what to do. All mind you, there are unsecured prisoners active on the premises. All Cold Ridge personnel detain or kill anyone currently in a restricted area. When I find you, it's going to be bad. Okay. Okay, I think we're okay. Whew. I'll find you. I know you're here somewhere, scum. Oh, I'll find you. Ah. 
Oh. Can't use my magic. Yeah, let's go down this low way. Oh, shit. Oh, 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 oh. I think they're shooting the rats, not me, I think. Oh, uh, maybe not. Uh, I'm just gonna go. Oh, they're shooting from up there on the bridge! Oh, I just gotta go and hope they don't kill Lizzie. I can't sprint, if you're wondering. Eh. Oh. Whew. Yes! <laughs> Let's get out of here. Oh, I missed a rune and a bone charm. <laughs> oh, wow, I only got like a third of the money. Uh, at least my overall chaos was low. Dunwall is changing fast. Six months ago, Draper's ward was where Dunwall's rich and well-born strolled and shopped and tried to be seen. The plague burned through it in days. Today it's a battleground where two street gangs fight over the spoils. The Hatters and Lizzie's gang, the Dead Eels. Lizzie Stride was the boss until Edgar Wakefield betrayed her and took her place. And the riverboat. It's the kind of thing that happens every day in Dunwall. I don't judge him. I've done worse myself. But I need that boat. Edgar Wakefield and I have business. Yeah. That money issue is a big issue. I can't buy much. A gift from Abigail Ames. Abigail Ames has contacted you through your network. She's offering a bone charm that might be useful to you in exchange for a small fee. I would like that. I don't think I can afford all of these, can I? Two, three, four... No, I can just afford all of them. Alright. Let's get them all. Hidden rune, absolutely. What is this? Allied whalers will dump a crate loaded with supplies overboard near the Undyne. You'll have to dive to retrieve the contents. Sure. And I probably can't afford a damn thing. I can buy two sleep darts, which I'm going to do because I only have three. textile mill used to run off a water wheel before the canal went dry. It started up again recently, and whatever the Hatters did to get it working has enraged the dead eels. They're fighting in the streets. The Lizzie Stride, leader of the dead eels gang, is captain of the ship Undyne. Aid Lizzie and use the Undyne to sail up the river to Brigmore Manor. Okay, well, I think this is a pretty good place to end the episode, so I hope you've enjoyed so far, and when we return, I'm going to try to get to the ship.